I'm Meech from On The Radar. Many know me on YouTube for my black seed oil investigations. Some have even called me the black seed oil police. This is Rashid. He's the owner of Bionatal. Many people consider his black seed oil to be the strongest on the market. We've decided to come together and do what has never been done before. Combine our resources by gathering black seeds from all seven countries who grow black seeds for oil extraction. We will have them lab tested to find out once and for all which region produces the best black seed oil. Follow our journey through every episode to see all of the crucial new information we discover along the way. Hey guys, this is Rashid by Nettle Company and today this is the second video you know, of our journey where we try to find out which black seeds and which black seed oil the most potent and the best on earth. We are doing something nobody did before. Uh, well guys, uh, subscribe our YouTube channel to join our journey, uh, follow all our uploads and also uh, you want to definitely subscribe on the radar channel the link in the description because on the radar is taking part in those uh, investigations and uh, Mitch uploading the videos with extra additional uh, information uh, so you're gonna uh, see full picture full uh, understanding uh, if you watch both of our channels uh, well guys first of all in the previous videos I, I said very important thing that whatever brand on the planet you buy whatever oil on the planet you buy it's gonna be extracted from the seeds from seven regions why it's so simple because only seven countries producing uh, those uh, seeds uh, grow in Nigeria city of flowers in huge quantities especially for oil extraction all other countries has no that quantity uh, and uh, uh, weather condition not allowed uh, for the flower to grow uh, for 100 percent and bring uh, the seeds so in fact in fact it's just seven countries and um, who provide uh, the seeds so uh, you if you want to know more you watch this video this is our first video of our journey at the end of the day guys for to know the potency and the truth about black seed oils we need to get only seeds from seven countries and we gonna make it we are the first company who gonna make it and we're gonna make analysis for it and we're gonna know the truth which uh, seeds are the best so today the first video of uh, comparing the seeds and uh, uh, I will give you information starting from now in uh, the next videos I will give you information uh, real quick about all the seeds you know we we're gonna receive all those uh, seeds from all seven countries and uh, uh, we, we, I will show you those seeds and uh, uh, will provide you information uh, where those seeds grows uh, uh, grow and um, uh, how much quantities and uh, everything you have to know well let's start this is Ethiopian black seeds you see and uh, you know that we have direct uh, supplies from our uh, Ethiopian farmers uh, we think on our opinion that black seed uh, black seeds from Ethiopia are the best um, the most potent this is why we're working with those seeds and this is why the first seeds on my table are Ethiopian seeds in this small plastic container Ethiopian seeds so uh, guys uh, what you have to know about Ethiopia why uh, it's it's good and potent uh, because thymoquinone uh, and uh, all other m minerals inside the black seeds uh, created by the heat heat and special uh, water uh, land also effective but nothing is more effective than than the heat and Ethiopian climate is the best for creating uh, thymoquinone all the rest of countries who produce black seeds they are more going on nurse so the temperature is going down the, ty the, the uh, thymoquinone is going down so uh, this is on our opinion right now but we're gonna prove in in a future videos by analysis right uh, so 
also Ethiopia has a lot of rivers this is the country number one in Africa who has a most numbers of uh, rivers in between the mountains and this is perfect uh, for uh, growing Nigella sativa plus in the mountains they have a lot of rains so uh, basically it's make uh, Ethiopian land the best for producing uh, Nigella sativa flowers uh, this is on our opinion right now before we get the analysis results okay so as for the quantities uh, Ethiopia providing Ethiopia understood that uh, people like this uh, uh, those seeds and uh, uh, Ethiopians know that they have the best that's why they're growing and growing every year unfortunately uh, government never provide Ethiopian government never provide uh, the information of quantities uh, particularly for the black seeds but we would not be bionetal and on the radar if we would never find out of course we got it so this is the information guys for the 2021 okay uh, Ethiopia produced total spices 37,000 tons all those spices are 109 109 kinds of spices from those 109 uh, kinds of spices 50 are standardized by ISO what does it mean standardized by ISO it's something which is has common analogs in other countries so if I will tell you cumin if I will tell you sesame, if I will uh, tell you fenugreek all, all that you can find also in another countries it's standardized by ISO uh, but in total it's 109 positions in Ethiopia Ethiopia provide information on the quantities only on all of the best uh, spice they produce for centuries it's a, a black coffee black Ethiopian coffee now, other positions they never provide information but of course we have people who investigated who got the information two years ago after that we just approximately calculated how much land start to be involved in growing Ethiopian black seeds and we find out that for today for 2021 it's approximately the black seeds in Ethiopia approximately 3,000 ton a year this is approximately 3,000 um, tons a year uh, it's still it's still big number but not of course the biggest uh, and the Ethiopian government knowing that uh, black seeds getting more more popular every day nah, they want to make it uh, so big as uh, black coffee nah, and they want to uh, support farmers so uh, hopefully it's gonna be more 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 Ethiopian seeds in future and more Ethiopian black seed oil in future which is good for uh, all people on earth uh, of course uh, we know the city uh, we know the information from the Ethiopian government how much they want uh, to harvest um, a hectare uh, plant uh, how many uh, hectares uh, or acres if you want to so um, in Ethiopia for future for example like five years or whatever and according to uh, how many tons we, uh, Ethiopians get from one hacker uh, we calculated that Ethiopian government plan is to make a crop 14,000 uh, tons 14,000 tons I think it's unbelievable and it's impossible it's very doubtful for me because even India by official information which is by the way can be lower than the real situation but by official uh, uh, information India who is a grower number one in the world they provide 7,000 tons so what does it mean it means that Ethiopia want to be double uh, produce double more seeds than India than the country number one who produce seeds oh uh, well we're gonna see but uh, if it's happened somehow it's gonna be a benefit for uh, all people on earth definitely but not the other countries who produce <laughs> black seeds okay so where you can find uh, uh, Ethiopian black seed oil 100% Ethiopian uh, black seed oil and this is guys very big problem and be always careful I will tell you listen to me carefully I will tell you real situation um, and you just think about it just be always careful with that uh, Ethiopian seeds the most potent and the, 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 the most expensive especially after pandemic the price for Ethiopian seeds rise for 250 percent even other seeds already rise for 200 percent price but Ethiopian 250 percent rise right now uh, 
it's extremely expensive it was even extremely expensive due to the market price even a year ago before the pandemic and uh, this is why those seeds go in mostly for mixing with other cheaper seeds why because for example in other countries uh, i will tell you in what countries india uh, sorry not india uh, i'm i'm apologize uh, it's uh, egypt and turkey they collect seeds from everywhere and they have a lot of weak seeds so they bring the ethiopian seeds they make a mixes and i know personally the uh, owners of the companies who does that and i know the brand uh, which has which claims that it's Ethiopian black seed oil it says Ethiopian black seed oil and the owner and he never lie and and he always says that I put 30% of Ethiopian seeds and 70% of Syrian seeds you know what I mean so what does he what what he's doing he's rising up because he has a lot of Syrian seeds so he rising up uh, the level of uh, time of quinon adding a little bit of uh, Ethiopian seeds he make color darker and the price for his oil still cheap due to the cheaper price for um, uh, Syrian seeds and it's everywhere guys look all the North American countries for Ethiopian seeds the best markets uh, Asia not the United States not the United States not even close you know what I mean? Because the United States go in everything cheap. I don't know why, but it's a fact. Turkey, India, everything in the United States. So the main uh, market, Asia, probably they have a pure form of uh, black seed oil. But as for the Middle East and especially North Africa, Morocco, Tunis, Algeria, Egypt, um, those people getting a lot of uh, Ethiopian black seeds and they make all those mixes from those countries uh, coming Ethiopian uh, black seed oil which is not 100% Ethiopian uh, Europe the same 50% of countries mixing seeds 50% countries in Europe they provide really Ethiopian uh, black seed oil so on my opinion my personal opinion maybe 50% of Ethiopian black seeds are going for mixes it's not a pure form and even the label say it's a black seed oil Ethiopian black seed oil uh, by fact like I told you right now the sample uh, that inside is just 30% of Ethiopian seeds and by the way this oil come in bulk into United States to so some companies who buying from Egypt supposedly Ethiopian ex uh, oil uh, uh, extracted from Ethiopian seeds but in fact it's coming 30% Ethiopian and and uh, 70 Syrian uh, a lot of games on the market a lot of games this uh, business unknown this business growing faster than people can get information that's why uh, it's a big mess really it's a huge mess so you always have to know from where to buy real Ethiopian black seed oil the bionatal black seed oil I just put it there because I have the bottle there but you don't see it <laughs> the bionatal black seeds are definitely from Ethiopia and we have 100% Ethiopian pure black seed oil and our certificates and analysis all on our website okay so this is it for today guys so um, next video will be Syrian black seeds stay with us subscribe and see you in the next uh, video of our journey see you guys after that by the way I forget to uh, mention this one more time when I have here all seven regions seeds we're gonna extract oil you're gonna see all the colors you're gonna see I, I will tell you the potency of all the oils we're gonna make a rank one two three four five six seven by the taste and the color and then we're gonna send it to the laboratory for full analysis and we will compare how really the color and how really the bitterness affect the results of nutrition inside the oil interesting right we're gonna be the first company who does it so uh, uh, stay with us guys, see you in the next video.